Born Liars is a thought-provoking book that delves into the fascinating world of deception, exploring why people lie and the psychology behind it. In this video, I will discuss seven valuable lessons extracted from this book, providing insightful perspectives on the complex nature of deception and its implications in our lives. 1. The Evolutionary Roots of Deception The lesson of the evolutionary roots of deception in the book Born Liars explores the origins and motivations behind deception that can be traced back to our evolutionary history. Evolutionary roots of deception indicate that deceitful behaviors have developed over time as a survival strategy. Deception has allowed humans and other species to gain advantages in various aspects of life, including competition for resources and mating opportunities. This lesson delves into the concept of adaptive deception and how it has shaped human social interactions. By understanding the evolutionary origins of deception, we can gain insights into why and how we engage in deceptive behaviors and learn to navigate the complexity of deceit in a more informed way. Exploring the evolutionary roots of deception also highlights the universal nature of deceitful tactics and provides a broader perspective on the prevalence of deception in human society. Finally, this lesson prompts us to question our own deceptive tendencies and consider the role deception plays in our personal and collective lives. 2. The Different Types of Lies We Tell and Why The lesson The Different Types of Lies We Tell and Why in the book Born Liars explores the various categories of lies that humans commonly engage in and the underlying motivations behind them. We all communicate falsehoods for different reasons, often with the intention to protect ourselves or others, to enhance our social standing, or to manipulate situations to our advantage. White lies, for instance, serve as social lubricants and are designed to maintain harmony and avoid conflict in relationships. Meanwhile, lies of omission involve deliberately withholding information to avoid negative consequences or to maintain control over a situation. Sometimes we even indulge in self-deception, lying to ourselves in order to maintain a positive self-image or to avoid confronting uncomfortable truths. Understanding these different types of lies and their purposes can provide insight into the complex nature of human communication and the underlying motivations that drive our deceptive behaviors. 3. The Consequences of Dishonesty on Relationships The lesson of the consequences of dishonesty on relationships in the book Born Liars explores the detrimental effects that dishonesty can have on interpersonal connections. Firstly, when individuals engage in dishonesty, whether it be through lying, deception, or manipulation, it erodes trust within relationships, leading to a sense of betrayal. Trust forms the foundation of any healthy relationship, and once broken, it becomes challenging to rebuild. Secondly, dishonesty can breed resentment and create a hostile environment, as individuals feel deceived and hurt by the lies. This can lead to increased conflicts and emotional distress within the relationship. Additionally, dishonesty can hinder effective communication as the fear of being caught in a lie may cause individuals to withhold information or misrepresent their feelings. Consequently, such a lack of transparency hinders genuine connection and prevents the deepening of emotional intimacy. Moreover, the consequences of dishonesty extend beyond just immediate relationships, as it can also damage one's reputation and credibility among a wider social circle. Lastly, the lesson explores how honesty and openness are crucial for the long-term sustainability of any relationship, fostering genuine connections, mutual understanding, and emotional well-being. 4. The Role of Deception in Politics and Society The lesson of the role of deception in politics and society in the book Born Liars emphasizes the pervasive nature of deception in these spheres. Politics and society are intertwined with dishonesty, where individuals often resort to deception to gain power or manipulate others. 
Deception serves as a tool to shape public perception, with politicians and leaders strategically crafting narratives that may not always align with reality. This lesson sheds light on how deception is employed as a means of control, perpetuating social hierarchies, and maintaining systems of oppression. It brings attention to the potential dangers of deceit in politics as it can erode trust and compromise democratic processes. Furthermore, the lesson explores the ethical implications of deception in society, urging readers to critically analyze the role of truth and transparency in building a just and equitable world. The book highlights the need for individuals to be vigilant, questioning the information presented to them, and actively seeking the truth amidst a landscape of deception. Ultimately, this lesson underscores the importance of accountability and integrity in politics and society encouraging readers to challenge dishonesty and strive towards a more honest and trustworthy collective. 5. The Art of Detecting Lies and Deception The lesson of the art of detecting lies and deception in the book Born Liars is focused on equipping readers with the ability to identify falsehoods. The author explores various techniques and indicators that can help uncover deception in different contexts. The book emphasizes the importance of reading body language, facial expressions, and vocal cues to catch inconsistencies. It highlights that liars often display signs of discomfort, such as fidgeting or avoiding eye contact. Additionally, the author explains the significance of verbal cues, including excessive defensiveness or inconsistencies in the person's narrative. Through understanding these indicators, readers can enhance their ability to detect lies and deception in their everyday interactions. 6. The Gray Area Between Lies and Self-Deception The lesson of the gray area between lies and self-deception in the book Born Liars explores the complex territory where lies and self-deception intersect. It delves into the blurt line between intentionally deceiving others and deceiving ourselves. The author highlights how individuals often engage in subtle forms of self-deception, convincing themselves of their own lies. This lesson prompts readers to question their own role in these gray areas and examine the motivations behind their deceitful behaviors. It emphasizes that lies can be both directed towards others and internalized as a means of deeply ingrained self-deception. The notion of this gray area challenges the binary distinction between truth and falsehood, suggesting that dishonesty is not always black and white. Instead, it presents a nuanced perspective on the complex psychological dynamics at play when lying or deceiving oneself. The lesson ultimately pushes readers to confront the uncomfortable reality that lies and deception are not purely external acts but can also arise from internal contradictions in self-protective mechanisms. 7. The Ethical Dilemmas and Moral Implications of Lying the lesson on the ethical dilemmas and moral implications of lying in the book Born Liars delves into the complex nature of deception and its consequences. It highlights the ethical questions that arise when individuals choose to lie and the moral implications that can impact both the liar and those on the receiving end. The lesson explores the potential harm caused by lying, examining the erosion of trust, damaged relationships, and the potential for a cascade of deceit. It also raises important questions about the intentions behind lying, whether it is to protect oneself or to harm others. Additionally, the lesson discusses the various ethical frameworks and theories that can be applied when considering the morality of lying, such as deontological ethics or utilitarianism. It invites readers to question their own personal beliefs and values when it comes to truthfulness and honesty. Ultimately, this lesson prompts readers to critically examine the repercussions and ethical ramifications of lying in order to make informed choices about their own behavior. Thank you so much for joining me today on this journey through the pages of Born Liars. I hope you found the lessons and insights on the book both engaging and informative. If you enjoyed the content and found it valuable, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more in-depth book lessons and insights. 
Until our next literary escapade, happy reading, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care and stay inspired.